We are now coming up on the 50th anniversary of the Apollo 11 mission, which uh, took astronauts uh, to the moon, and Neil Armstrong had the opportunity to put his foot uh, on the surface of the moon. It was a giant step for, for mankind. Uh, you know, in the next few years, we're going to see a lot of missions uh, to the moon. We're going to see commercial flights going up there. There could be a, a lot of activity up there, and I think it's essential that we protect what is really the first archaeological site outside of the planet Earth. Hi, I'm U.S. Uh, Senator Gary Peters uh, from Michigan, and uh, you're in my office, and you can probably see that I, I like space. I have a lot of uh, space memorabilia throughout the office. The American flag in each of these, they've traveled into space. I still remember uh, vividly uh, the Apollo mission and where I was uh, when the landing occurred. I was actually in France. Uh, my mother is a French war bride. My father met her during the Second World War, and I was with her spending the summer with my grandma and grandpa and my aunts and uncles, and 10 years old, uh, and everybody was uh, really excited about a moon landing. Uh, we watched uh, the landing on a little black and white uh, television. And what was really exciting about it is that everybody throughout Reims, the city that I was in in France, were so excited about the moon landing. And what I think is remarkable is the fact that the space program and, and the kind of achievement that the Apollo program represented for humanity was something that brought people together. The folks that were landing on the moon weren't just U.S. astronauts. They were Earthlings. They were people from Earth who uh, were landing uh, on the, the moon and representing all of uh, humanity. We hope that this will be a symbol of what our feelings are, what the feelings of the Apollo program are, and a symbol of mankind that we can live in peace and harmony in the future. I think the moon uh, will likely uh, change a lot in the years ahead as we continue to have human uh, space uh, exploration. You know, with uh, commercial activity coming to the moon, with many more missions likely to come to the moon, people are going to be really curious about these sites and they may get too close, uh, they may disturb the site. In order to commemorate uh, this anniversary, I've actually introduced legislation. And what this act does is it protects really the, the first archaeological site uh, not on our planet. It's the place uh, where our astronauts uh, landed, not just in Apollo 11, but also the forward missions. I think one of the amazing things of the space program as well, this is about humanity reaching out to the planets and the, the stars, and we can all come together and be united. And I could see that as a young man when everybody in France was just as excited as my friends back in the United States to see that we had landed on the moon. Want me to make sounds, rocket sounds?